and welcome. This is Redris, and we are still playing Pokemon Black 2 on the YouTube side. I already made my gem quota for the day, so if we don't make it to a gem, that's perfectly fine. We dinged it on the bell. Okay. Now we find an Elgim. If we can manage. He has a 15% spawn chance, so he should not be hard to find. Hello! And great balls. Data. Okay, cool. And Elgium is captured. Who is? So the next thing on the list is going to be Zangoose, I guess. Um... I kind of just want to get out of here, so let's not battle too much. Yeah, I guess I ought to head back to the city area. Was kind of, oh, hi. Got along with your Pokemon, yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah, former Pokemon Center receptionist. Oh yeah, I like this guy, he's fun. But let's deal with these twins first. Ooh. Sola Ana. Oh, Zangus and Surviper. Can I have your Zangus? Uh, yeah. I do need to put Jesus. I really don't want to lose to two little kids. That crush claw is rough. At Night Slash, I think I can still survive that. So the Surviper should go down. Cool. Which means Clink also is going to hurt the Zangoose. What moves do I have? Special attack up, special defense. It will not go with Flatter. You punk mongoose. Uh, 
I mean, if you're gonna keep false swiping, I'm fine with that. can move my EXP share because Gothita has surpassed everybody. Doubling down on Frillish was probably not a great idea, but I will handle it. As it is. That's funny though. They put a rotation, then a triple, then a double, in kind of close proximity. Ooh, X scissor. That's a nice one. Blip, blip. No. Is this the thick grass? Oh, no, the dark grass is up in there. This is this is thick grass, but it's not the dark grass, which is what I'm actually after. What you got for me, clown? It's a top ball toy. Okay. Ugh. <sighs> Ominous Wind. going with a Zangoose in it. That's a Cub Chew. I'm hoping this is the right grass, because I haven't paid that much attention. Though it is only providing one Pokémon. Oh yeah, you're... Yeah, we're not doing this. One's the dark grass. You're probably the dark grass then. Well, I'm lucky but not lucky at the same time with this. Because I already have a Surviper. I'm actually after the Zangoose. Mm. 
Yeah. I wish I could have taken your shed skin, because that would have made this less of a pain. Show me a Zangus. That's not a Zangus. Darn you all. For now, I think I'm just gonna start running from everything so I can get quicker spawns. Okay, yeah, we are in the tall grass, or in the dark grass. Let's go. Let me out of here. Why all of a sudden can I not get away? Explain to me why I can't get away. I'm asking the game to do that because this is obnoxious. It's nowhere near safe. Zangus, that's a watchdog again. Haha. -ha. Is it because I'm paralyzed? I can't run right away like I'd like. Let's go again. Spawn me that Zangoose, please. That's not a Zangoose. Game, you rude. That's a striker and a watchdog. It feels like the reason in this situation why I can't get away is because the two Pokemon that they have... The fact is that I have a... I have one Pokemon underleveled that just... kind of seems to prevent me running away. Which is rather obnoxious. For a game! when I usually don't have an issue like that. I don't want to toss out anything more, I just want to run! Yeah, 
Yeah, and that would mean, based off of the fact that I am a lower level, means that I can't get away. And again, it's obnoxious that I can't just leave, because I've, in most situations, always been able to just leave. Like, why would a Pokemon... Oh, I don't know. No complaining. I'm done with that. I'm done complaining for right now. I just don't like it. Yeah. I'm not trying to level grind, I'm trying to make progress. Like, if I was trying to level grind, I would leave... I, I would be fighting these things. Like, right now, I just need to catch... I just need one Pokémon to spawn, and the issue is that... It's a very low spawn rate, and most of the enemies I'm having to deal with right now are normal type, so... Well, part normal type, but the normal type prevents me from doing damage with my more damaging attacks. Granted, the Zigzagoon is also going to be an issue, but that's why I want to keep all of my... I'm, I'm trying to do this in a particular way. Yep, Zibstrika, that big meat bastard is... Let's see. Da-da-da! That's weird, that Gothit is able to learn it. I thought Cofagrigus would as well. Hmm. I don't have very many options here. <laughs> And the flinch statistics on this game are absolute ass, too. Because I flinch a lot for abilities that have, you know, 15% chances it's flinching. Let's try this again. Thank you. 
<laughs> yeah, I've got no real chance with this one. Oh, well. I survived. Because it was a stomp. Oh, wait, no, it was because it was not a stomp, I guess. Oh, that was close. Just gonna adjust some things real quick. There we go. Alright, let's move forward. Or at least try. Zigzagoon. Oh, there you are. Cool. Or not Zigzagoon, Zangoose. Oh, you've got a quick claw? That's interesting. Uh, yeah. Quick claw embargo. You probably don't have any of the same moves I've got. was a critical. That's not great. But it does mean I can whittle down the level here pretty well. New Crush Claw. Yep, that hurts.
Okay. Didn't think that was gonna just flat out work. But, I'm going to take a chance on these iron barbs. I'm okay with false swipe. And I got exactly what I wanted. Cool. Zangoose, thank you for joining the team. Yeah. Oop. Yeah. Oh yeah, I have to do Twist Mountain. Cool. That'll be fun. I think. Maybe. Uh, Zangoose can go to the box. And I guess we will... Uh, yeah, that works, because I know he has a fight for me. Or he is a fight for me. And we'll see how I stack up. Let's go! Also, on my notepad, I can remove Zangoose. Yeah. Yeah. Not bad. Um, you are also... yeah. Guard split? Okay. I think you just gave me more defenses? Overall? We're doing it again, huh? Again. Sure. Five. Yeah. That worked out. Mm, do you have... yeah. And Frillish has the XP share, right? Yeah. So we're good here. Frillish is actually going to be super useful in the next area just because of all the ground types. Oh, and we are at the end of this episode already? Really? We'll beat up this cub chew and move forward. Go to sleep. Really? How about Psy Shock then? It seems like it did better. Probably didn't, actually. Looking at it, it definitely didn't do better. It did about on par. There we go. 29. And Frillish gained some more. Jabba, jabba, jabba. Hello, Fungus. Mm, you can poison me. I think I want to try and run here. There we go. 
Yep, and we are at Twist Mountain. Yeah, we'll end the episode and we'll continue our journey in Twist Mountain.